I feel weird doing my good morning guys in front of you. Good morning guys. It's day number two of vacay. We're at Anakista, even though it's supposed to start raining in about 10 minutes, which is this huge, I don't even know what you call it. It's like a ski lift thing. And then there's like a place at the top of the mountains, whatever. I'll just take you guys with me, even though we're probably gonna get rained on, which sucks. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, I'd imagine it's sweet. Well, who like built this? <laughs> I'll be really sad if I lose my camera right now because somehow we got convinced. Well, not convinced, but we rode like a bus up here and it was sketchier than this. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I had my tripod. We're all done at Anakista. It's only one o'clock. We were here for like three hours. We ate bomb food. We took the bus up and it didn't even fit on the road. I feel like only two tires were on the bus. It felt like, what else did we do up there? Went on an obstacle course. You mean two tires were on the road? What'd I say? You said two tires were on the bus. No, there were four tires on the bus, but only two of them were on the road. What else? The lift. I already showed you that. It's terrifying. Yeah. Well, we still have the whole day left, so. It was supposed to start storming at noon and it didn't. What else did we eat? Something else up there? Or am I crazy? We just ate the nachos. Yeah, because I wanted Chunker's Shores, but we didn't get any. All right, we'll see you at our next destination, whatever that is. We went to a NASCAR speed park, NASCAR speed park or something like that. But there's a bunch of rides and there are little kids rides. But it started to rain a little bit and if it rains, they shut everything down, including go-karts. Ben wants to go, are you sure that's not it? Get on go-karts. That was a request of his on this trip, so we're going somewhere else now to go on go-karts. But we got Starbucks, and I need to chug mine because we're about to be there. That's so much caramel, and I can't even have it. We're here at Blake Jones go-karts or something like that, but I'm not going to bring my camera because it doesn't seem very safe. So, see you when we're done go-karting. We go go what is it called? Go-karted? Go-karting. There was no bumper cars. It says in the drift track and the bumper car was blue. Oh, we did it. It was extremely fun. We did three different ones and I'm a wimp and I just got in the cart with Ben. But it was so fun. Now, we don't know what, so see you wherever we go next. I definitely would have had a hard time with my camera on that thing. And it would have just been me screaming. All right, see you somewhere else. This is where we're eating dinner. Just finished eating and now I drugged uh, Ben into TJ Maxx and I'm walking around by myself with my camera, so awkward. Ben's getting gas and um, snuff so you guys want a TJ Maxx haul right now because there's nothing else for me to do and it's six o'clock but we already ate dinner our food was so good and the waiter was so nice we tipped him like $15 which is a lot for us because we're poor you know but anyway we ate there it was so good I got like just their regular burger with fried pickles as a side and then we got a milkshake and it was just I couldn't eat the milkshake Ben had it all to himself but there's a TJ Maxx in a Dollar Tree, which the Dollar Tree is the nicest Dollar Tree I've ever seen right behind our hotel. Um, I went in there this morning to get Ben body wash and 
What else did I get in there? Oh, razors to shave my legs and these little clips that didn't end up working on my um, hair. But I want to go back and do like a good shop there. And then, anyway, that's behind our house along with the TJ Maxx. So, the Burger Place store behind our hotel, TJ Maxx, Dollar General, Dollar Tree is all back there. So, we just walked over to TJ Maxx after we ate. But, we also got souvenirs. You guys want to see our souvenirs? We went to a store that everything was... 9.98 or under that's so cheap i got this hoodie i think it feels kind of stupid to like pay ten dollars for a t-shirt and get a hoodie for ten dollars so cute it's just basic and then ben got pretty much the same hoodie but i got a large and he got a medium because he's skinny this t-shirt just an extra large to wear with shorts or whatever and he just got this boring t-shirt his feels nice actually mine doesn't feel that nice we got drinks at Walmart, but you guys don't care about those. On to the TJ Maxx haul. I get dark chocolate covered blueberries every single time I go to TJ Maxx. They're always $3.99 no matter the brand. So chocolate covered, dark chocolate covered blueberries. They had um, milk chocolate, but we don't want those. I don't like dark chocolate. It's just with those blueberries, it's so good. I just ripped this open. This is the best. DW home candle I have ever smelled. It's called Sunday Morning. It has like pancakes with syrup on top so you already know it's going to be good. Oh my god. It is so good. It was $10 which I didn't realize but it's kind of a bigger DW home candle. I'm so excited to burn that when I get back to Kansas. Ben's going to get in the car and be like, you have stuff all over my seat. Ben got a pair of shorts, workout shorts. These were $13. 90 degree flex. I don't I don't really understand. We just dropped a pretty penny in there. These feel like swim trunks. Did Ben just buy these are swim trunks. Nautica for $20. Ben, I'm pretty sure these are swim trunks. Oh. He just bought $20 swim trunks. Why? He doesn't ever know what he's doing. And the biggest thing we bought in there were shoes for me. Ben kind of just grabbed them for me because I said they were cute. They're just like regular Adidas, Adidas. But they were only $35, which is still expensive. But I haven't gotten new shoes in so long. So that's everything. That's why we spent so much money in there. I'm going to ask him when he gets in here if he realizes those are swim trunks. He's, I already know. I bet you he'll say, I don't care. I'll still wear them to the gym. Watch. Because there's a really nice pool at our hotel and I don't have a swimsuit. Like, I just don't have a reason to own one or buy one just for that reason. Okay. Alright, well, that's our TJ Maxx haul. Oh, here he is. Let's ask him when he gets done pumping gas. Come here. Do you know these are swim trunks? Huh? These are swim trunks. What do you mean? They're swim trunks. Gym shorts, no. Like That's the way my other gym shorts are. They have a net in them and everything. Okay. I just didn't know if you knew they were swim trunks. Huh? I didn't know if you knew they were swim trunks. He's in the active. I think you can tell just by touching it that they're not. I'm so weird. Okay. <laughs> This is me ending the vlog that you guys just watched the next day because all we did was watch Chris Lee Knows Best because I got the TV to work. The sound on the TV wasn't working. Got it to work. We watched Chris Lee Knows Best, ate snacks, and went to bed early basically because we don't get to do that. So even that's kind of a luxury to us. So that's all you um, guys get for that day yesterday, which I know probably didn't seem like much to you guys because you guys didn't get to watch this go-kart, but that was like so fun i know my camera would have flown away though but anyway i'm gonna end this i'm currently filming this on our final day of vacation so you'll see me look in the same way and like <clears throat> in the next video so all right bye guys